When you mix self-determination with power and inspiration, you only get one personality and that is Oprah Winfrey. From being raised in rural poverty to becoming one of the wealthiest women in the world, Oprah has certainly made it clear that obstacles only help to make you stronger. Her show, The Oprah Winfrey Show, went on to become the highest of its kind and ran for 25 years. Following her success as a host, she went on to form her own network, The Oprah Winfrey Network, in 2008. With her professional life facing very little bumps on the way, you'd expect her personal life to almost be the same. But there are some shady truths that Oprah and her boyfriend, Stedman Graham, have been holding back. So, today we've gathered some facts about the power couple that may surprise you. But before we get into the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to be the first one to watch our videos. Engaged but not married Usually breaking off an engagement means that you're actually breaking up with your partner. But that was not the case for Oprah. After getting engaged in their house in 1992, the couple decided on saying I do in November 1992 but the ceremony never took place. The couple postponed the whole marriage thing but soon stopped discussing it. Mr. Oprah When you are involved with someone as famous as Oprah, chances are your identity will be overshadowed. The same happened to Stedman who before 1997 was known as Mr. Oprah. The whole story was covered by a 1997 New York Times segment titled, They Used to Call Me Oprah. Not that seeing your partner become one of the sensational icon is upsetting, but the New York Times bestseller Stedman author just wanted the people to know that he is more than just Oprah's boyfriend. Oprah's Trust Issues Before Stedman, Oprah had dated a number of men including John Tesh, Roger Ebert and Michael Jordan. Due to unstable relations with the men she dated, she had a difficult time trusting Stedman. Even her close friends and producers thought he was a player or wanted something. But the man sure did prove them wrong by being nothing but the supporting partner that Oprah needed. Rumors Over the years, the couple had to fight off rumors of split, cheating scandal and more. With that being said, the rumor of Stedman cheating on Oprah with her hairdresser was uncovered by the Chicago Sun-Times in an article titled Cormy Gossip by columnist Ann Gerber. Gerber later retracted the story after finding out that the claims were unfounded. But Stedman was not the only one who was once accused of having an affair. Even his spouse, Oprah once battled the speculations of a romantic relationship with her best friend, Gail King. I understand why people think we're gay. There isn't a definition in our culture for this kind of bond between women, said Oprah while denying the speculated rumors. Weak Faith One thing Oprah does not need to worry about is Stedman cheating her on with Gail King. The best friends have already discussed the issue and have clearly stated that Stedman is off-limits. In a conversation between Gail and Oprah, the Gail King show host said that Oprah shouldn't even be upset about the situation and should just take her to the hospital because she has lost her mind. Oprah calls her relationship with Stedman untraditional. One of the major reasons for Oprah's relationship going strong with Stedman is the fact that they aren't married. In an interview with Vogue, the host went on to say that marriage would require her to become a wife and the whole scenario is pretty traditional which isn't what the duo are looking for. The couple believe that this is one of the best decisions that they have ever made and want to keep the relationship that way. Is Oprah and her boyfriend's decision to not get married a wise one or not? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel.